What is probiotics, the good bacteria? Probiotics advocate the consumption of food or dietary supplements containing live microorganisms, usually bacteria, with positive activity, and the ability to break down nutrients into desired materials for storage. There is no clear evidence yet that these bacteria are able to settle regularly in the intestines, and therefore recommend daily consumption of probiotic products to maintain the beneficial activity of bacteria. Probiotics is based on the principle of maintaining the balance between beneficial bacteria and harmful bacteria, and allowing them to be returned to the body of beneficial bacteria after infection e.g., after the administration of antibiotics. The purpose of probiotics is not to make a radical change, nor to replace the intestinal population, but rather to contribute to the diversity, and optimization of the relationship between the bacterial populations in the intestines. Two main types of friendly bacteria live in the human intestine, lactobacilli and bifidus bacteria. These bacteria live in cooperation between themselves and the body that stores, and they have a positive effect on our health and many bodily functions. They serve as a barrier against the intrusion of pests into the body. They protect us from pathogenic bacteria and viruses. They help to break down food and digest it. They help stimulate the intestinal immune system. They have a positive effect on drug efficacy. They produce essential vitamins. They produce fatty acids that nourish the mucous cells of the colon. Violation of the ecological balance of the intestinal bacteria may harm our health. This explains the need to maintain this balance, and to encourage the growth of friendly bacteria. Who needs probiotics? In the optimal state, our colon has a good amount of bacteria on the order of 10 to 14. However, sometimes the population of good bacteria in the colon is affected, which can lead to the development of digestive difficulties, urinary, and vaginal infections and other problems such as allergies and skin diseases. There are many reasons for the depletion of the population of probiotic bacteria in the body. Including antibiotics, diarrhea, intestinal infections, poor nutrition and even stress and air pollution. So taking probiotics may be essential for anyone at different stages of life. Unlike other nutritional supplements, probiotic bacteria do not accumulate in the body, so there is no fear of side effects or overdose. Probiotics can be taken regularly to strengthen the digestive system, even without a medical indication. What should I check before buying? The amount of bacteria in order for the probiotics to have an effect, they must contain a very large amount of bacteria. In probiotics the amount of bacteria is measured in billions. What foods contain friendly bacteria? Today there is a wide range of probiotic products in the dairy industry, yogurts, cheeses, fortified beverages, and nutritional supplements. These products contain lactobacillus and bifidus bacteria. An example of probiotic food is the yogurt produced by fermentation of bacteria in milk. Live yogurt contains lactobacillus bacteria, bio yogurt also contains bifidus lunum. Thank you for watching.